All right, guys, KB32 here. Check it out. So I thought I'd just take a minute after we did a function test on that new rifle we put together and a video for the guys out there at Callaway Blessing. So anyway, um, I'm blown away by what happened uh, yesterday. And I'll just start off by saying this, man. I've got friends of mine who are gone, okay, protecting and doing what they had to do for our country, okay? Some people may disagree, but I really don't care. Uh, but here's the thing. The, the, the environment that we have these days is absolutely ridiculous. And uh, I'm saddened by it, tragically saddened, because there are people out there who are taking advantage of what we call free speech, protected by the Constitution. Free speech, and then there's that one thing we all love is the Second Amendment, okay? And you wonder why the Second Amendment is directly after the First Amendment. Well, that's because it's very important that we the people are able to protect ourselves from a government that has gone awry. So you've got a bunch of people who run and jump and they still, they take flags down their own government property and uh, they burn stuff and they're def defacing government property and they're doing all kinds of crazy stuff. Oh, wait a minute, that's the guys that did the insurrection. I'm sorry, wait, whoa, wait a minute. But the people yesterday were just voicing their first amendment. Now, I would say that some people that is one badass truck. <laughs> so anyway, some people out there uh, are okay with this. Do what you want, burn the flag, burn you know, mannequins, uh, chase people down, beat them in a the corner. Um, I'll say this, uh, and this is directed at the people who are out there, and I know nobody's gonna watch my channel, right? Uh, this is directed to the people out there. You are gonna do that shit to the wrong person at some point in time, and your little flaming ass is going to get hurt. You've never served in the military. You've never done a whole lot. There might be one or two of them in there, and I don't know why you're in there supporting this kind of crap. Now, granted, here's the thing. There's a big controversy with the guys over there, the Israelis uh, and the Palestinians and Hamas, okay? Um, the way I see it is, uh, I'm gonna, I need to know, if I, if I tell you what my true thoughts are, I might get in trouble on this video, <laughs> so I'm not gonna do that. But you probably know what I'm thinking. Uh, if you're going to stand there and uh, protect these people, then you are those people. So what? And I put a video out a long time ago that said, Hell hath no fury like a pissed off fucking Israeli uh, who had 12, 1400 of his own people killed, murdered, tits cut off, children burned in ovens. They put babies in ovens and cranked them up and turned them on and let mom and dad watch them before they cut their arms off in their heads. The most sadistic shit I've ever seen in my life. Hey, listen, if you're going to do it, just blow people up, but don't sit there and murder and torture and do what you did because i'm asking you what did you think was going to happen oh hell no okay uh but the individuals who sat there rashida talib um kiss my ass you dumbass i know you'll still be in office next year because that's that whole area is full of the arabs and they just love your ass but anyway Here's the thing, I'm sick and tired of people telling me that we, our democracy is in danger. Uh, yeah, I know it's a republic, okay, so we don't have to say anything. So, but the whole deal is, is uh, our democracy is, we're in danger of losing our democracy. We're in danger of losing this. We're in danger of losing that. Fucking be my guest, because I'm sick and tired of it. The lies, the people who sit there and screaming and hollering about democracy are the ones who are stealing it from you. Black Lives Matter, the anointment of, of uh, Kamala Harris, no one voted for her. They're the ones stealing democracy from you folks. Our republic, see it's our republic and, and democracy are two different things, okay? So anyway, but they're the ones who are stealing this stuff and they're doing it right in front of us. And it's absolutely disgusting. And I ask, I cannot stand it. She wants to, uh, she, oh. I don't even want to get started in it. But I do know one thing, my second amendment is, is important to me and dear to my heart. And I'll be, gosh, bless America if I'm going to let somebody come in and, oh, forcibly confiscate my stuff. You want a civil war, honey? You're going to get one. The cackle queen, bring it on. All right, I'm done. I'm sorry. I like what I do. Uh, I enjoy shooting videos, and I enjoy staying away from the politics. I really do. I pick a certain thing that I go at, but oh, I stay away from politics. Are you kidding me? That's what I make money with. All right. You guys let me know what your thoughts are down below. Can't believe this stuff is going on. It's hot and covered with gnats. Little bastard had a tick crawling on me the other day. Eh, ain't nothing like having a bunch of leeches on your legs and in your waistband, right?
you know who I'm talking to. It's Coda Boy 32 If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already done so. Always in them like this. Yeah, I did that. All right, God bless America. God bless those men and women. Uniform 24-7 for our freedom. Guys, because freedom's not free. These asshole things, they're so entitled that they can go to a government building, tear it down, and nobody's beating them the hell out of them? That's not free speech. That's an insurrection. It's KB32. I'm out of here. Dude, y'all be good. I thought this would be a good background here.